Hi and welcome to Brizzy. My name is JP and today we're going to talk a little bit about taglines. They go by different names and people will give you different versions of them. But to show you briefly what a tagline is, here I have a page that we have from one of our starter templates. And then we have the heading at the section at the top. And then under the heading, we have this little bit of extra information. Sometimes it's referred to as a sub heading or a below heading. Many different ways we can refer to it. But the purpose of this tagline is to tell you a little bit more about what you can expect in the section. But let's be frank, how many of us actually do read these taglines when we go to a website? I hardly do because actually people don't spend enough time to really understand what they want to say with a tagline. So I just look at the content and the content tells me very quickly what's going on in that section. But there is a real good reason why you should consider using taglines under your heading. And it's all to do with SEO and also now with AI, finding what's going on on your website and then other people are searching for those things can find it much easier. To put it in the word of my good friend Claude, SEO benefits taglines allow additional relevant keywords to be included near the header, which can help with search engine optimization. And I think that word there, the keyword is very important. If you've ever worked with SEO, you will understand what keywords are. If you've never worked with SEO, Keywords are those words that your Google and your Bing and all the others, they look out for them, they find them. And when other people search, like you and me search for something online, it will look for those words. And if your website has those words, it will return as a result. And you kind of want that, especially if you want people to be able to find you online. With the Brizzy AI, that's what we are talking about today. I'm going to show you how you can create great taglines from scratch or those that you already have there. Before I do that, remember to give this video a like because we thrive on the likes. And then also remember to subscribe for the latest updates, news and what more for Brizzy. And then visit us at brizzy.io for the latest news. We have a blog section there. We also have a section there where you can make recommendations in what you would like to see for Brizzy WordPress and Brizzy Cloud. What I'm showing you here can be done in both WordPress and Cloud. And of course, we are talking about the AI text generator, which is only a pro feature. Two ways you can work with the AI text generator. Already I have a tagline here, and it's important now we're talking about text. So usually I really don't like reading, but because we are working with text and the contents of the text, we are going to do a little bit of reading here. So our section here is about why business professionals should attend attend what? Let's go look what this website is all about. It's about expert coaching. Aha. Uh -huh. So this guy here, Johnny, Jason, Julia, whatever, is doing some coaching. And then this section here are going to give you four reasons why business professionals, that's going to be our target group, should attend this coaching. So it's all about that. Let's look at the tagline. Business professionals should attend our workshop because it provides valuable, practical insights and cutting edge strategies. This is what we got from the client. Is it good enough? Yeah, I think it's good enough. But let's see what AI can do with it. When you select on any text element, the AI function, AI text generator is going to appear here all the way to the left with the little stars of magic. And when you select that, you get the dialog box where all the magic is generated. Now, with the text on the page, you can use these prompts to help you work with the text that you already have, not generating from scratch, but using the text you already have. Now, important when you work with a tagline, you don't want it to be long. I said earlier, I think I said earlier, you are aiming for something less than 20 words, a short thing. So you could go for shorten and you could go for simplify. Difference between shorten and simplify. Let's leave this text and we'll duplicate it so we don't mess with the original. And I'll go to shorten. And what we expect is to see it shorten. We have here business professionals should attend our workshop for valuable insights and cutting edge strategies. It's taken out because it provides. I do think this shorten is maybe a more concise. I won't say it's shortening, but it did its best. Let's duplicate it again. And this time we hit on the duplication simplify. For business professionals should attend our workshop, uh, nothing major going on here. And you can also change the tone. So if I duplicate it again and we go to tone, I could say, let's go for confident. Let's see what it does. As it offers extremely 
well, when you use the word extremely, you are super confident. Extremely valuable practical insight. Great. But I'm going to delete these. I want to work on the fact that we want to work from scratch and how we can tell the text AI generator to write a good tagline for us that is focused on SEO and strong keywords. Let's first talk about generating from scratch. I'll duplicate a new one and we work with the bottom one. Go to the AI text generator. If this box here is empty and you give the AI an instruction within this box, it's going to generate new text. It's going to completely ignore what's on the page and give you new text. So what I'll do here is I'm going to tell the AI, write a tagline for my coaching business and why business professionals should, should attend my course. Course or coaching, I'm not sure if it's a seminar. Once you've written that, you can click there. I'm just going to hit enter and it's going to completely change everything. The AI, it looks like it wrote a huge thing here, but I found that whenever I tell the AI text generator to write a tagline, it puts it within the quotation marks. So the, this part here at the bottom is actually additional information and you can delete it. The tagline is unlock your potential, achieve your goals. And then you have this bit under here. I've clicked out and unfortunately you will see that when you click back in, your prompt is g -g gone. And that's a big pity because I would have liked to have kept that prompt. So what we're going to do is write the prompt again, write a tagline, why professional should attend my course. Let's hit enter and we leave the box open this time. Oh, wow, this time we got something very different and I wonder why it has done it this time. Unlock the secrets to effective communication and negotiation for business success. That's pretty impressive. But I want to show you now why the importance of the word tagline comes into play. If I go to the prompt and I'm not going to close or click outside here, I'm going to highlight tagline. Also remove the uh. Write why professional business people should attend my course. Now, remember, every time I use this prompt box, it's going to replace everything within the text box, text element. So when I hit enter now, just because I took out that word tagline, look at what it gives me. It gives me an overall opinion. And this is how the AI sees it. I need to convince professional business people why they should attend the coaching. So it's going to give a very big argument here. If I say write a sentence, why professional business people should attend my course, and I hit enter, you're going to see we get a sentence. But note again that this sentence is still maybe a little bit too long for a tagline. If I say write a tagline, and just by changing those prompts, look at that, I get a much shorter thing. And again, this AI loves to put everything that's a tagline within quotation marks. We can also say write a subheading, and this more or less gives the same as a tagline. You see very, very short. Subheading is even shorter. And these are the important words you should take into consideration when you are writing a tagline. My recommendation is if you're writing a tagline using the AI text generator, use the word tagline. The AI knows at that moment exactly what you want. It has searched the internet a million times and it found out that when people talk about tagline, this is kind of what they mean. So we put back their tagline, write a tagline, why professional business people should attend my course. And boom, there we go. Unlock the secrets of effective communication and negotiation for business success. That's a pretty cool tagline, wouldn't you say? Let me change this prompt a little bit. Write a tagline, why business professionals should attend my course. Let's see if it does a major big difference here. Unlock the power of data analysis and make sure it's smarter, better, or comprehensive. Of course, this is what I was for. I was looking for this word course to come into the tagline. You can also restrict the tagline. This is something I do all the time is telling the AI how many words it is allowed to use. If I count these words quickly, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, to me, that's within my 20 word limit, but let's restrict the AI and say less than 14 words and see if it can manage that. Ugh, 
it manages it. Master the art of effective communication for business success. I'm going to remove the 14 words thing and see if it can bring the course word back. There we see. Unlock the power of data analysis, make smarter business decisions with our comprehensive course. I do like that word of the comprehensive course in there. What we are going to do now is give this tagline the SEO power that we want. So what I do here is I will tell it, write a SEO focused tagline with keywords, why business professionals should attend my course. Unlock your potential, master business strategy and leadership skills for success. If you've worked with keywords and you've done a lot on SEO, you will understand why this title is very different than the previous one, even though it looks like it's telling you more or less the same. Words like unlock, potential, master, strategy, leadership, skill, success, all of these are very big words in the world of SEO and the combination of them into keywords and keyword phrases are very important. And that is what I'm telling the AI to do at this moment. It changes the entire feel of how this tagline is written. What I've just done by adding this SEO focused with some keywords and the AI is doing the job for me is that when the search engines and the AI come to your website and they you know, browse through your website and they crawl through it and they find all the little text and strings that they are focusing on this. So if somebody go online and say, I want to master my business strategy, guess what? Yours may just come up. And this is the power that I think in terms of what the AI has done for me in terms of headings, even my content and then taglines is helping me to just elevate my impact on how the search engines and the AI will see my website when they come to my website. From here, you can even fine tune it more. Look at the tone. We talked about the tone earlier. I can set it to professional. And once I do that, it's going to do the same. It's just going to step it up a little bit more. la di da unlock your potential, gain expertise or gain in business strategy and achieving success. Brilliant. I wonder if I can undo this. Going to hit control Z. It doesn't do that. So unfortunately, once you've generated it, it's not going to give you that option to go back and see your previous version. The trick here is that if you get to this one, that is the professional one, and you're like, okay, I like this, go ahead and click on duplicate. Just remember, once you've clicked duplicate and you close out, you're going to lose your prompt here. So let's go ahead and highlight our prompt, and then I'll say Control-C, Command-C to copy that. And then I'll hit duplicate so we can go to this one, Go to our AI, let's go to Tone, and choose Confident. See what it does. Unlock your potential by acquiring expertise in business strategy and leadership to achieve success. So Confident is saying you will unlock yourself and you will achieve to achieve success. Whereas the previous one, more professional, was using the word for achieving success. Small changes in the syntax, but really powerful. The last thing I want to focus on is if you already have text on the page, how you go about changing that. So let's go to the original text given to us. Let's delete these two. And we try and do this the normal way we think we should do it. What we'll normally want to do is select everything the way you would select all the text. And in my case, I usually like the right click option. So I'll go right click and I'll click on copy. And now I go to the AI and I'll click on paste, but there's nothing there. And the reason is that copy we did didn't copy the text. This copy is the element. This is not the text. This is a brizzy copy function. So when you copy it like this, just remember you're not copying the actual content. You're copying the whole element. That's just one of the things that happens when you have a right click interface within the builder. Can I still select all of this text? Yes, I can. Can I copy all of this text? Yes, Control C, Command C. So I'm going to go ahead and hit Control C. And here you have to know the shortcut. The right click is not going to work for you. I've already hit Control C. Let's just do that again. I'll highlight, ooh, not all of that. Let's highlight again, Control C, and on Mac, so Command C. We go to our AI generator, Control V, Command V. And there we have it. That's just how you have to work with it. It's going to be like that. What I'll do now is I'll give it the instruction, the prompt at the beginning. Write a 
right? A SEO is and so it's and right and SEO tagline with keywords and I'll just put colon and I'll click on enter. Empower your business with practical insights and cutting edge strategies at our workshop for professionals. Wow, we that is pretty awesome. We took that tagline that was okay. -ish, we made it very powerful. I just want to, oh, I said SEA, my fault. It's, it, it kind of knew what I wanted to say, right? What I want to show you here is again, the power or rather the care of using words. When I started playing around with the AIs, I would say write a strong SEO tagline. And I want to show you how much of a difference it makes if I say something like write a strong SEO tagline. It becomes kind of very <laughs> strong. Empower your business. It is looking for strong words in the keyword spectrum. So you have these words of empower. If I change this, like write a professional, which is similar maybe to the tone, but I found it does change it again. Write a teaser SEO tagline. Let's see what it does here. It changes it quite a lot. And look at what it did. It added even hashtags there for me. Gain practical insights and cutting edge strategies at our workshop for business professionals. Don't miss out on valuable knowledge to boost your success. Wait a minute, you say, JB, I shouldn't be putting hashtags in my tagline. Say so. Every word you actually add extra to your prompt is going to change the length, the tone, and the feeling. But if you're doing your taglines, I recommend stay with the word tagline or subheading. Subheading is going to be shorter. If you're not using the word tagline, then restrict it by saying no more than 20 words. The difference is when you add the word tagline, the AI is trying to mimic what it understands wherever on the internet it has seen taglines. And it's trying to copy and emulate that as close as possible. So if you use the word tagline and your prompt is a tagline, you're going to get a professional tagline. That's just how it is. And that brings us to the end of our tutorial on how you can generate impact, powerful, SEO-driven, keyword strong, professional, what other words can we use, confident, uh, taglines for your headings within the sections with the AI text generator in Brizzy Pro, and that is for Brizzy Cloud and Brizzy WordPress. From me, JP, I'll see you in the next video. Remember the like, please, and visit us at brizzy.io. Until next time.